Hello, I'm Nick Roberts. And I'm Jaden Bowers. And today we'll be talking about our 2016 Morris of the Year nominee. Okay. For our Morris of the Year nominee, we chose Miss Murray. We chose Miss Murray because she is very straightforward for what she wants in the classroom and that and what she wants done. Uh, last year for CST or religion, uh, our class had Miss Murray, like most of well, like all of you, right? And um, it was really cool because she was always there. And like even uh, like firstly being a great teacher is one thing, but like Miss Murray, it's also being there, and, like, like getting to know the students. And she'd always sit down with like, every table group, just talk to them about stuff. And uh, good afternoon, Miss McGraw. So um, today we're just going to be talking about uh, Miss Murray and how we nominated her to be uh, Marsh of the Year. So um, the first question we've got for you is, uh, can you recall a time where you worked closely with Miss Murray? Yeah, so I've worked closely with Miss Murray um, with the H, she's one of the Year 8 homeroom teachers. I'm also a Year 8 homeroom teacher and a floater and also in the staff room in general, she's always been there, so I've worked with her. Um, and what was it like working with her? Uh, working with Miss Murray. Um, it is different and it's a really good difference. She's very gentle um, the way she presents herself. She's a very calming um, person and also how she interacts with students. Um, she doesn't like to yell. She likes to use a soft tone of voice to um, grab the students' attention. And she's also very present in the classroom with her students and also with the other staff. Um, so, out of the five Morris characteristics, which one do you think Miss Mari most closely embodies? I think Miss Murray definitely portrays love of work in the way she carries herself out, uh, especially with um, her photography. She's always at staff events, um, school events, at the masses, um, school activities such as athletics carnivals, swimming carnivals. She's always there taking photos of the event and send them um, to the appropriate uh, teachers that need them. But also, just overall, she puts a lot of effort into her um, class work. Um, that she prepares and also when she's in the classroom it really shows that she loves what she does because she's very helpful with her students she's always there to make sure that if they're struggling that she can really help them through those difficult um, questions that they need to answer. Um, do you believe that Miss Murray should win Maris of the Year? Yeah I definitely think um, Miss Murray is a worthy winner of Maris of the Year because she not only portrays love of work but she portrays all of the five characteristics especially um, in the way of Mary, presence, uh, simplicity, family spirit. So I think she'll definitely be a good All right, thank you for your time, Miss. Good afternoon, Angelo. Good afternoon. I'm going to ask you a few questions about Miss Murray as a teacher. Um, have you studied under Miss Murray? As such? Uh, yeah, in photography. In photography. Um, what was it like work, I mean, studying under her? Um, well, it's kind of... Uh, it's kind of peaceful. You get what I'm saying? It's like, there's not really a lot that goes on. Uh, it's just really calming experience. It's very peaceful. Okay, um, do you think Miss Mari could win Maris of the Year this week? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I definitely think she's, uh, she can definitely win it. What, what about her makes you think? Oh, uh, well, she's like, she's always there, I suppose. Like, you don't notice she's there, but when you need her, she's I hit my head like, and she doesn't really, she's not really loud. I guess you could say she's, she's very simple. Um, but yeah, she's like, she's always there. And okay, so when Miss Mari is teaching you in photography, what why uh, what vibe does she give you? And your oh and your man, this is like very calming vibe, man. It's like she doesn't shout a lot. She if if anything, she doesn't shout at all. So she's always with uh, a soft voice. It's really peaceful and calming when uh, you really listen to it. Um, so there are five characteristics inside the Mars charism. What charism? I mean, what characteristic do you think she displays the most? Um, I think maybe uh, love of work, probably the most. Because like it doesn't matter which event it is. She's always going to be there with some other students taking photos and then making sure those photos go to the right people, whether it be to the office for the newsletter or whatever. How does work, uh, how does Miss Mari's work around the school affect your student life? Well, um, when we're in class, like right after recess or lunch, we're always like kind of restless because, you know, we've just been running around. And she will often like 
somehow, I don't know how, but she always does. She gets us to calm down. And this is like, I think this is very important in a teacher because um, we're always stressed about class, like whether it be the test, the topic test, the exam, or whatever. And just being able to calm your students is just a really great uh, quality in a teacher. Um, can you describe Miss Mari's personality? Oh yeah, um, she's very reserved, very gentle person. She's uh, always, um, she's not really loud as a person. She's, she's always reserved and timid. But, and she's never forceful, that's what I want to make sure. Thank you for your time. Oh, it's been a pleasure. Uh, can you recall times you have worked closely with this work? I work with Miss Myra in photography as well as soccer. So she's the other soccer coach for Seven Bs. I was new to the sport and, well, new to coaching at Mars, and she really helped me with how to run the team, how to run some different drills that I could do, and also managing the students on the bus and at the games and things. She was very helpful. She gave me a lot of tips. Um, what about Miss Mari makes you believe that she'll be a great Mars at the end? Well, she definitely attributes one of the Mars presents, um, family spirit. She is very loving to her students. She cares about them each individually. She looks as, looks to everyone as a whole. Um, she sees each person as very unique as who they are. And she, her, her soccer boys, she's very passionate about. And I know that through the years, she really she's very encouraging to those boys. From this, she hasn't been the seven, and all the way through, she remembers who her soccer boys are. She's very positive about them. Do you think she should win maths with you? <laughs> um, I think that everybody who is nominated should win. I think that all the teachers that I've spoken about have some form of qualities of Maris and that there should be really no winner, that everyone should be awarded and recommended. Um, how does her work affect okay. you like you? Well, she's very helpful in particular with photography and setting up new programs. She sort of, at the very beginning when I was thrown in a bit of the deep end and I didn't know what I was doing, she showed me how to create an assessment task and how to write the rubric for this school. And she very, she sort of gave me a good structure to work with and that has sort of benchmarked me, enabled for me to be able to go forward and design my own programs in the future. Yeah, um, how does the vibe with my hands around teachers? Miss Murray is very calm and caring. She's quite uh, a nurturing sort of vibe that she has. Thank you for watching our video. We hope you enjoyed it. Please vote for Miss Murray.